Uh, anybody want to hear pure evil, right? Uh, I'm a fan of the Lotus Eaters. They do really great stuff, great work. And um, <laughs> these are panelists that they're going through, right, on um, public... Uh, I, I can't. I don't know whether it's radio or, or TV. I think the TV stations, right? And um, so they're going through these people, and then they're mentioning the Economist magazine, and uh, you can hear some real. It's pure evil. Constantly, the Economist is constantly putting out communist apologetics. Mm. Why Karl Marx was right and all this sort of thing. And it's just like. In, oh, they recently put out a study under the cover of this on <clears throat> show on Wednesday uh, that says, according to the World Economic Forum, it's going to take how many years to achieve gender parity? And so we looked at 134 countries and we found that there are still a contingent of women who don't go back to work. How do we fix this? Did you hear that? There's still a contingent of women not gone back to work after having children. How do we fix this? This is this ideology, right? It destroys us at a fundamental level. We are tribal, we thrive best in small family groups where we give each other security, we bond strongly. So when shit hits the fan, you got somebody you can rely on, <laughs> your nearest and dearest, right? And especially the mother-child bond is so important because it's the first place where the child receives unconditional love and therefore has a chance to develop trust in the world. And they don't want people who have trust in the world. They want people who are constantly frightened, constantly feeling scared, constantly feeling threatened. And the way to achieve that is to break up the bonds. So when you break up those bonds, you lose that sense of security. And that is pure evil. There is no other word for it. Because it destroys the human soul, you see. I just thought I'd put that out there. When I was a child in school, we learned the um, German, oh, what was it, Grundgesetz, you know, the foundational you know, our Bill of Rights, whatever. And the first preamble was the smallest unit in a state is the family, and it is therefore in the utmost interest of the state to protect that smallest unity, the family. It's supposed to be under state protection. That used to be in our Grundgesetz. I don't know whether it's still there, but it's certainly being disrespected right now. 